Hello. Welcome, welcome to the basement. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's see. I did find some things. I did. And I think these are things I might even put online. Because now, at the time that they were cleared out from Kohl's, the bookstore, people were like, oh, who would want that? But now, it's years later, decades later, so there could be somebody out there. And what am I talking about? Children's books. Indeed, do, 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 do. here is one for Honda, 1973 to 82. Now, are there many of these cars left? No, probably not. And this was at Kohl's for 99 cents. Civic, 1973-82. Civic, or sorry, Civic CVCC, 75-82. Accord CVCC, 1975-82. Prelude, 1979-82. Includes Canadian models. And, of course, has it really ever been messed with? No, not really. 55 ways to improve fuel economy. Anyway, as all with these things, general maintenance, uh, tune-up and performance maintenance, engine and engine rebuilding, emissions controls and fuel systems, chassis, electrical, clutch and transaxle, suspension and steering brakes, body troubleshooting, Chilton, book company, indeedy. And there are diagrams. There are pictures. There are probably pictures of diagrams. Oh, what is this funny page here? Ooh, here's a colored section in the middle. Oh yeah, I guess this is the Chilton's Fuel Economy and Tune-Up Tips. Stuck in the middle, in color. Lovely. Lovely. But what do I do with it? I'll set it over here. And now the rest are similar things. Here is Chilton's Repair. Oh, this one's had a little... Not... I don't know what, well, maybe a little liquid damage on the end. Anyway, Chilton's Dodge 1968-1977. Similar kind of idea. But once again, for somebody who has a car like this, this could be handy even if just to display with it. And here, uh -huh, this is from Climber. On the 100 to 350 cc overhead cam singles. There we are. CB100, SL100, CB125, S, SL125, XL125, TL250, XL350, CL100, XL100, CT125, TL125, XL175, XL250. This book is another in the world's largest selling motorcycle series. The climber books are in order for delivering more troubleshooting, repair, and maintenance information than any others. More photos, drawings, charts, compact carrying, carry along size, emphasis on tune up, troubleshooting, frequently needed information, exclusive high performance modifications for track, sport, touring, quick reference pages for vital specs, more exploded views, strips of the trade from factory mechanics. Competition experts. Exclusive full-color wiring diagrams. Indeed. Engines are a wonderful thing when they're working. Now here is one. Boy, this has had a history. In terms of it's being marked down like three different times. It is the Fiat 2 Repair and Tune-Up Guide. By Chilton. And... This guide covers the full range of cars from 1973-1973. This book is divided into chapters on the major systems of the automobile. Cool. I don't know how many Fiat's there were in Canada. But, you know, you know, you know. You never know, you know. Oh, no. You know what I feel? I feel like this pile. As I put that book on here. 
is trying to lean to the front and crash down. Not going to happen. I will move them back here to the pile. What do we have here? A book. Children's. Oh, looks like it's had a little damage on the top. Children's International Scout book. Uh, Children's International covers all models from 1967-73. This book is logically divided into ten separate chapters. La -la 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 -la. And what? Yes. The International Scout. Oh, now here is something. Okay. I'll shuffle these. VW Liquid Cooled Engines. And this book was produced by Canadian Tire. Produced for the Canadian Tire. By Haynes Manuals. Oh, that's another famous company that made manuals. VW models covered Dasher, Sirocco, Rabbit, Pickup, Rabbit, Diesel, Pickup Diesel, Jetta, Quantum. MDD. And then finally, the big boys. Chilton's Dodge 1968 to 1977 tune up guide for the Dodge. Big, big monster cars they were. And it's a pretty hefty book. It is. Oh. Uh huh. And here, I think at the time, I don't know what happened. Anyway, books, yummy books. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. So I figure most of the Kijiji Facebooky type things, they let you do a certain number of pictures. I don't know if it's 10, I forget if it's 12, and it may be different between the two of them. I will put up one ad. Um, with individual pictures of all these books and probably put up a price for all of them or individuals. Of course, the price for all of them will look more attractive than the price for the individuals. Um, and who knows? Maybe we'll find somebody out there, some book collector, some car collector, somebody with a specific car that might be covered. Oh, this one covers the Valera, Monaco, Royal Monaco, and the Monaco Girl. This is the uh, Children's Dodge. They were big cars. I don't know if there's anything in here. Oh, yeah. Look. Here, I don't know how well you can see this, but there is a picture. And those cars were big. Fuel economy was not something that was, well, you know, it's a funny thing. We go through these cycles. Gas is cheap, and everyone's buying big things, and then suddenly gas goes up, and it's like, oh, my golly, what have we done? And, of course, now, soon, we'll be electric. Let's see what poor Richard has to say. If wind blows on you, If wind blows on you through a hole, make your will and take care of your soul. Huh. The rotten apple spoils his companion. Don't throw stones at throw. Uh, don't throw stones at your neighbors if you own windows. If you own windows or glass. That almost sounds. But anyway, the excellency of hogs is. Badness of men, virtue. Receive before you write. No, yes, receive before you write, but write before you pay. He that would live in peace and at ease, must not speak all he knows, nor judge all he sees. 
it's really, sometimes these things are one line things, and sometimes they're more than that. Uh, if what most men admire, they would despise, T would look as if mankind were growing wise. Oh, this is a whole, I'm screwing this up. enough. I've had a long couple of days. I'm tired. I am tired. So, so be it. All right, so, car books. Now, what I will do, I suspect, and I hope the weather is cooperating, I think it is, is I will take these things outside, I will put them on the hood of my car, and I will shoot pictures. And then... I will see about putting up the listings. Perhaps I will look and see if there are more. There are, as I said, seven here, and I could probably do more than that. Ten or twelve. Anyway, first thing is shoot the pictures, then figure it out. And certainly putting them in one ad is faster than putting them in individual ads. It is. If I was doing it on something else like eBay or something, I would probably do individual ads um, to get the individual buyers who might be interested. Anyway, we'll see. We will see if anyone bites. We will. Anyway, these would be, of course, well, some of them are referring to cars that are, you know, 55 years old or so. Not all. All right, I will go and look for more things. Thanks for coming. Have a lovely, lovely day. Bye for now.